Hello everyone, my name is Parth and I welcome you to our channel Must Watch Tips. So today in this video, we have a challenge of making this presentation where we have three types of chips in different flavors. One is salty and another one is classic with party size and the next one is pickles flavor. And as you can see, these are beautifully animated. And the color chosen is same as the wrapper of that particular chips packet. So I'm going to show how to make this step by step. And now without any further talks, let's get into the video. So let us start with a blank presentation. And the very first step is that we need 3D models of the chips. And I have that downloaded it in my computer. So I will go to insert, go to 3D models and I will select this device. I will select the respective chips. And I will click on insert. So at a time you can in import multiple number of 3D models. And you know what 3D models are, right? So if you are not aware what the 3D models are, you can go to our channel. There I have explained how the 3D model works. So the 3D model basically has this uh, rotation button from that you can rotate your object like this and it is the GLB format file. Now for you my friends how you can download this so you don't need to go to website and search for 3D models. I have provided download link in the video description so you can directly download it from there and it's totally free. And now let us duplicate this slide. So I will select the slide press ctrl D twice. So now I have three slides in total. Now in the first slide, I will put the yellow chips down here and the pickles flavor above the red chips. Okay, we need first slide as well. So I will just press Ctrl D and in the first slide we have just a title. So I will Rotate this like this and place it right over here. I will make it smaller. So in the very first slide, we doesn't have anything. Let's just move this slide to first position. And in the first slide, we don't have anything, just a text box. We'll go to insert shape. And let me have a shape over here, a rectangle. Now we'll go to eyedropper tool and I will select this red color which has which we have in our chips wrapper i will select no outline and let us go to insert and insert a text box we'll say header of this slide we'll make it bigger and let us choose this font this is just the header now our main work starts from here so now from the first slide we will copy the rectangle go to our first chips slide and i will paste it over here now what i did is in the very first slide title slide the red chip was in the position like this and in the first slide where we wanted to display the actual chips i will bring it to front and i will rotate it from this button which we have let us maximize it like this and this is how it will be displayed now in the second slide i mean including the first slide it will be the third slide so we will put this red uh, chips above the slide area like this and we will rotate it like this so it will add an animation effect to our slide so i will put it over here the green chips would be somewhere here. You don't want to display this. The next is the yellow one because in the first slide where we have kept red as the center, I, we have kept yellow downwards. So yellow will come here. Sorry, in the second slide. So we will put yellow like this. And again, we will copy the rectangle from here to slide number three. And let us choose the same color which we have in the wrapper. So I'll select this color. 
I will bring this to front. And now you must have guessed that in the third slide, we will be having the pickles flavor chips over here in the center and And in the same way, we will copy this rectangle, place it over here and let us go to shape format, go to eyedropper tool and let us select this green color. Let us bring this to front. And now we are ready with our three of the slides. Now let us go to first slide, copy the header. I will go to second slide where we have kept the red colored chips and now let us write something over here so I will type salty I will place it like this just above the rectangle which we have placed I will press ctrl D to duplicate this text box I will place just above it and for this text box I will go to text outline and select red and in text fill I will select no fill and if I wanted to increase the border of the text so I will go to this and increase its border like this I will duplicate this and place it just above this so now we have completed the first slide I mean the second slide with uh, chips having red colored wrapper now if I go to second slide I need to put the same thing over here but before that in the second number of slide I will copy this all go to slide number 3 I will paste it all I will go to shape format and in align I will select align middle then I will move all this to bottom of the slide area go to second number of slide copy the text box and I will repeat the same pattern over here. So I will write classic. We will go to shape format. And in the text field. Let us select the same color. Which we have for the rectangle. We will duplicate this. In the text field let us select. Text outline. Let us select yellow color. And in the text field let us select no. Again we will go to weight. And increase the border width and let us duplicate and place it like this so let me show you how all the slides looks like so first slide looks like this where we have salty placed over here we have the red chips and the yellow chips in the second slide we have the header gone above the slide area we have red chips at the center and the text boxes are splitted into this three and the yellow chips is just below the red chips so in the next slide we have yellow in the center red moves to up and we have in pipeline the pickles flavored chips and in the third slide we have the yellow chips move above in the main slide area we have the pickles flavor and the classic text box which we had in the third slide is moved down now so this is all you need to do to make this presentation ready and now let us see what we have made